guys, welcome to Gary Elementary PE. So today we're going to play a game of tic-tac-toe relay, okay? And you're going to need a few items. So as you can see on this side, I have created a tic-tac-toe out of socks. My husband's socks and I needed 12 of these. And I also created a tic-tac-toe on this side out of chalk, okay? Now, you can play this game either outside in your driveway or you can do it inside the house. You're just going to need to make sure that there's space in your living room or your dining room or your hallway or wherever you're playing. You're going to need somebody else to play with. So you can either have your siblings play with you, or if you have a neighbor that's about your age that wants to play, you guys can play together, okay? So the other things that you're gonna need is you're gonna need, I got six of my daughter's little food toys, and I've got six socks for my son. So each person's gonna need their own items that they're going to use for Tic Tac Toes, because we don't have any X's or O's, okay? So you could use bottle caps, you can use money, whatever you have around your house. Now, if you also, if you don't have socks or chalk, you can also use kitchen utensils. You can also use straws if you have straws. Whatever you have at home to create your lines for tic-tac-toe. Or if you want to get a, um, a piece of paper and draw it on there, you can draw it as well. So it's up to you. You can be as creative as you guys want. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to um, have two people are going to stand behind a line and you guys are going to run and try to make the tic-tac-toe as fast as you can, okay? All right, I hope you guys enjoy it and I can't wait to see you guys later. Bye, Gators. All right, Gators, as you can see, I've created two types of tic-tac-toe patterns. One that is made out of socks and one that is made out of chalk. You will see my students, my students, my kids are right back here and they either have, my son has his socks and my daughter has her play food. So we have about six pieces of items, so you will use whatever you have at home to play this game, okay? So when I say go, one at a time, they will grab one item, and they're going to run to their tic-tac-toe spot right over here and place it. The student that makes it back the fastest and completes their tic-tac-toe will be the winning student, okay? Here we go, go! Tic-tac-toe, you have to put three in a row. Either straight, vertical, horizontal, or a diagonal. And we have a winner. Good job, Amari. Great job, Mila. Let's play with the tic-tac-toe that I created out of chalk. All right, ready guys, set, go. And Mel wins again. 